The year 2009 was challenging for the entire media industry. The economic crisis caused advertising revenue to collapse. At the same time, the industry underwent structural change. More and more people turned to the internet and mobile devices for their news. Ringier's response was quick. It cut costs and developed a new strategy. The Ringier workforce are systematically implementing this strategy. And at group level, the Central and Eastern European operations have been combined into one division. New launches and acquisitions are proof that Ringier has strengthened its core business and expanded its digital segment. In Slovakia, a new internet portal, Vashchas.sk, was started. It joins Madame Eva, a magazine for women over 35. And Novichas Stavie is a new weekly insert for wellness and health. In the Czech Republic, Reality and Bidleni, a real estate supplement to the newspaper Blesk, was introduced. And Blesk.cz, an internet site for women, was established. In Serbia, Ringi acquired the magazine Nin. In China, Shanghai Family was launched, an English-language magazine, as well as cityfoo.com, a website featuring 13,000 nightlife tips. In Vietnam, a new cooking magazine called Bepke Din was introduced. In Croatia, Ringier took over the real estate platform Photo Nekretnine. In Hungary, Pink.hu was created, an internet portal for women, as well as Neon.hu, a new site for young people. The weekly women's magazine Blick Nook was strengthened by Blick Nook Otto Han and Kert, a home and garden insert. Another insert, Blick Nook Koninja, features cooking tips. A magazine was added to the sport paper Nemzeti Sport, and Bravo now includes Bravo Love. Here is an in-depth look at each country, starting with Switzerland and Germany. In Switzerland, there's a strong trend towards the internet and cell phones. The user numbers of Blick.ch have increased by 37%, and the Blick i app has already been downloaded over 60,000 times since it was launched. Ringier is at the forefront of these developments. For example, the creation of an integrated newsroom for the Blick group began last year. All texts, photos, and videos for Blick, Blick am Abend, Sonntags Blick, and Blick Online are now generated in one combined newsroom. Although the newsroom was Ringier Switzerland's largest project, it wasn't the only one. 2009 was a very hectic and a very important year. Not only did we develop a new strategy, we made it work. This strategy focused on our core business, newspapers, magazines and printing facilities. The major project certainly was the Blick Group newsroom, now up and running. But our strategy also means a new emphasis on entertainment, covering television, radio, good news and ticketing, all at a fast pace. Transaction-based business models on the the internet are a third part. We moved all three elements forward significantly in 2009. Schweizer Illustrierte continues to be the most successful people magazine in Switzerland. Glückspost also had a good year with a 7% increase in readership. Another milestone was the development of Ringier's entertainment unit, which combines all of Ringier's radio, television, event, concert and entertainment activities. And the entertainment unit continues to grow. For example, Ringier acquired the rights to the world's most important television festival, the Rose d'Or. Ringier also entered the ticketing business with a German partner, CTS Eventim. Through the classical company, Ringier brings world-class performers of classical music to Switzerland positive news in the radio segment as well. After a long period of uncertainty, Energy Zurich has finally received a license. In 2009, Blick, the most widely sold daily newspaper, celebrated its 50th anniversary. It returned to a broadsheet format with a separate sports section. And one of the most state-of-the-art printing facilities in the world went into operation at Ringier Print in Adligensville, with a capacity of up to three million newspapers per day. Now Germany. Michael Naumann is the new editor-in-chief of Cicero, the leading magazine for political culture, while the art magazine Monopole has had a new look since last May. 
In 2009, Ringy 8 Czech Republic reinforced its position as market leader. Blesk remained unchallenged as the most popular newspaper in the country. Reflex was named Magazine of the Year for the fourth time. We're proud of last year's results, despite the worldwide economic downturn and the media market situation in the Czech Republic, we managed to exceed budget targets in Czech crowns. This was mainly due to the results of Blesk Daily, but there were other successes too. For example, the increase in subscription for Blesk Progeny and the weekly magazine Reflex. Last year, we also made significant online investments, especially in the Blesk portal. That investment paid off. The number of visitors to blesk.cz rose 43%. The news portal was also strengthened with a section for men. And Blick for Women, Blesk Progeny, now has a separate portal. These initiatives mean that Ringy 8 Czech Republic has become a leader in the country's online segment. Ringier Slovakia, too, remained market leader, in addition to launching the women's magazine Madame Eva. The digital channels especially have been significantly expanded. From the moment we went into the electronic media market, we took a leading position, despite a previous unsuccessful partnership. Immediately afterwards, we entered the market under full power. Today, we're in the top 10 with our portal chas.sk. We also launched vashchas.sk, a favorite with internet readers due to its user-generated content. By successfully relaunching lesk.sk and several other projects, we expanded market share even more. Last year, Ringy acquired all the shares of the Euromedia joint venture from Bauer Verlag, enabling Ringy management in Hungary to make decisions quicker and continue expanding the magazine portfolio. The purchase of the Bauer shares shows that we were energized in 2009. Not only did we restructure the magazine division, we focused on our dailies, particularly the online portals. For example, NOL, the online edition of Nepsabacak, doubled the number of visitors in 2009. This increase exceeded the market growth rate and was equally characteristic of other Ringy A portals, such as the sports portal, the Blick. It was extremely important that Medialog stabilized its operations in 2009. We're very happy with its results after restructuring. The good news from Romania. In April, the country's foremost state-of-the-art printing facility opened in Bucharest. The bad news was the economic crisis. It hit the country hard, causing a significant drop in advertising. Romania is suffering from a major economic crisis. As a result, daily newspapers especially lost up to 80% of their advertising volume last year. Overall, the advertising market dropped 50% in 2009. We responded with a strict cost-cutting program and discontinued the giveaway paper Compact in February 2009. We also eliminated a number of jobs. The Ringier Romania portfolio was restructured after divesting two newspapers, Iverimentu Zile and Capital, and closing Diva. Advertising revenue in Serbia declined by over 15%, although Ringier Serbia continued to invest and acquired the political magazine NIN. 2009 was extremely challenging for Ringie Serbia, but from the start we responded to the crisis with more aggressive marketing and greater innovation. High points in 2009 were the acquisition of NIN and the integration of its editorial staff into the Ringie structure. Allo now appears in tabloid form. Jenablitz.rs is the first internet site for women in Serbia. With an average of 1.48 million unique visitors per month, Blitz.rs was one of the most visited news platforms and received an award for best news portal. In China, the portfolio was enhanced by the English language magazine Shanghai Family. 2009 did not begin well. We uh, decided to restructure the company and close down two weekly publications, Oriental Sky, 
and Shimon Bella due to the decline in advertising revenue. Following that restructure, we focused our efforts on building e-commerce for Betty's Kitchen. We used uh, the products from Betty Bossy in Switzerland, which we made available uh, to Chinese consumers online in China. CAAC and City Weekend both did well, and we're looking forward to 2010 with the Shanghai Expo. Last year, a new magazine was launched in Vietnam. In addition to the fashion magazine Toy Trang Tre, Ring Yie now offers a cooking magazine with the title Bep Gia Din. In 2009, Ring Yie Vietnam continued its success with Toy Trang Tre, but we were also very happy to bring uh, Betty's Kitchen models from China and Switzerland to Vietnam. Um, our family cooking magazine Bep Gia Din was launched in November, and we also prepared to bring uh, several international titles to uh, Vietnam, as well as a digital media platform. This is a real estate portal. It'll soon be joined by a regional print magazine. In the ongoing process of change, Ringier relies heavily on its employees. Due to the new requirements of a modern multimedia company, they face considerable challenges and are provided with the right support to meet them. An example is the Ringy Academy dedicated to personnel development. In the past year, 700 employees attended approximately 30 seminars. In Bratislava and Prague, workshops were held about online and mobile publishing issues. In Switzerland, the Ringy Academy prepared over 400 staff members from the Blick Group for their responsibilities in the new integrated newsroom. In 2009, Ringy started its new sustainable strategy according to the motto, Inside Out. The objective is to consistently harmonize the company's economic activities with the environment and with society. A typical case was a group-wide campaign to encourage Ringier employees to reduce paper use. The measures taken in various printing facilities significantly curtailed emissions and energy consumption. Based on the group model, Ringier Hungary introduced its first CSR or Corporate Social Responsibility Report in accordance with international GRI standards. And in Vietnam, Ringier's Daryu Foundation for the third time received a prize as one of the top microfinance institutions. The foundation was created to build schools and award scholarships that enable children to attend school. In the digital segment, Ringier focused on transaction-based online platforms where products and services are bought and sold. The Media Swiss Group with its strong Scout brands, took over Anibus.ch last year, the leading portal for classified ads in French-speaking Switzerland. That made Ringier the most successful internet company in Switzerland. Media Swiss expanded into three other countries. In Croatia, it acquired the Foto Nekretnine real estate platform. In Vietnam, the Media Swiss group bought the Not Viet Group, a software developer and operator of a real estate site and Necronine.rs, another real estate platform, was added in Serbia. Finally, Ringier's e-commerce platform, Geschenkidee.ch, also had a successful year, offering tens of thousands of items in Germany. 2009, a difficult year. Ringier worked hard to cut costs and reposition the company. New opportunities must be seized to build up, expand, and invest in the core business and the digital segment. That will ensure Ringier continues to be a winner.